So we are here at Walmart in my college town of Mishawaka. And I have to say, I have not found this many new cars in a store in a very, very long time. This looks like a almost complete Case D. So you had the Lightning McQueen as the Easter buggy, Mildred Bylane, the Easter buggy himself, Ruby Easy Oaks, the Easy Idol racer, two of him, Green Ramon, Hardney Parsper, Mama Bernoulli, there's an Aiken Axler, Taco, Suki, he's new to the case. That's awesome. I'm so excited. I'm so thrilled to finally find some new cars. We got Mildred Bylin again. She is heavy and she looks beautiful in that gold. We're at Meyer here in Mishawaka and they have remnants of the new deluxe case. They only have two of them, but it's the two that I need. So that is Team 95 and 51 Mater and uh, Leroy Traffic with snow tires. So we'll be picking those up. And then they have remnants of Case D of uh, 2021 singles and a ton of Bruce Boxman and Lewis Hamilton three or two packs. So I'm happy about that. This might be one of my most painful experiences ever in the store. We have one little tease of a Case E car, and then the rest is just absolute trash. You got Raul Sarul, Aiken Axler, Patrax, and H.J. Hollis. Some decent mini three packs that we already have, and some old two packs. God, that is literally painful. I cannot believe that. Well, it looks like the disappointment will continue, because here we are back at that same Mishawaka Walmart, and they have some remnants of Case E. Here is Trainer Cruz Ramirez, and they have two Andreas. So I don't know how many Andreas are in Case. I would assume only one. It was the second Andrea. I really just saw her, but either way, though, some more. Oh, there's it. Either way, not the best selection in the world. Lots of remnants of Case D too. They do have the new five pack with the. 95 team from cars too so i'll probably pick up one of those let's see if they have a, a sheldon shifter endurance racer there's some color changers there's a rich mixon doesn't even look like they have sheldon shifter that's interesting i'm gonna try and look to see if they have any uh, easter baskets but well, they have the king color changer too that's nice So I'm here at Target at Mishawaka, my college town, and they have some remnants of what looks to be Case E. You can see Bob Coley here. I'll be picking him up. The two Jimmy Cables. So I guess they got in two of the case. I don't see a smother stop tractor though, unfortunately, and he's obviously the highlight of the case. So that kind of stinks, but you do have lots of junior moons. They have a trainer Cruz Ramirez here. Andrea. Lots of H.J. Hollis's. Lots of mini three packs here. I'll definitely be picking up uh, some of this stuff here. So that's awesome. It is April 15th and here we are at my college town of Mishawaka Walmart. I know I like to say that a lot, but it is a good day. Just by showing you guys this, you might be like, eh, not really. I mean, they got the June Faster Hauler. First time they've named him. But if I go up a little bit, uh-oh. We got the new NASCAR singles. So we have William Byrev here. 
That's exciting. We have Carson Ace Dillon for Sidewall Shine. That's also exciting. Let's see if they have Chase Racelet. I know they have a Lightning McQueen down here. Oh my God, I just dropped that. Oopsies. Saw a Jackson Storm. It does not look like they have, what's his face? Chase Racelet. That's okay. I prefer these two anyways. And then they have remnants of case D of 2021 singles. Overall, not a bad stop at all. They even have some nice endurance racers. All right, I'll definitely be picking up those two. Here we are at the Mishawaka Target, and I'm quite delighted actually. They have remnants of case G and F. First time seeing either of those cases for me. And so we have a Pam Wheeldaro. Now I'm sure the only reason she's left is because there's two in the case, a Fast Fong, the next gen Rebman go. I'm not sure if he's also in case G, but either way, there's one of him. And those are really the only two notable cars. They have Flo, Lewis Hamilton, haven't seen them in a while. Aaron Ludfoot. They have a lot of the Radiator Spring singles. And I'll show you some more of those in a second. Some HG Houses. Some two packs, but unfortunately not the ones I need. They have, yeah, the Sheriff is up here. Oh my goodness. Blowing Bubbles Meter. Radiator Springs McQueen, Sally, Doc. I pulled a Luigi out. They also have some of the new Mini Racers 3 packs with Gale Buford and Tokyo Mater. Don't think they have the other one. Let's see the other one in this case. It doesn't even show it. It's there. I'll show them on the back. They totally show other ones on the back here. Oh my god, no, they don't. They used to, like here. I promise you, they used to. Yep, there they are. I guess not for 2021. Yeah, we just have some of the repackaged ones, it looks like. Some little amigos from Ramon. No new color changers. But yeah, not a bad store at all. I'm very excited about those singles. So now we're here at Walmart and I got here at the exact right time because this employee was taking a box, like a case E box of singles. It was open, but she was taking it like away and over that way. And so once I saw that there was Jack squat here, like literally disgusting this, I chased her down and look at all the goodies I pulled from that box. We might be able to go take a look in the box again, but of course we have Spother Stop Tractor and some McQueens with trophies. I'm not so sure Francesco Bernoulli is exclusive or new to the case or not. Lost track, but yeah, pretty excited about that. Man, perfect timing. So now I'm back at home, my hometown. Done with college, feels great, but doesn't feel so great to see 17 Aiken Axlers on the pegs. Like, what is going on here? Oh my god, there's really three characters on the pegs. There's H.J. Hollis, J.D. McPillar, and they can act. So I guess Pat Jackson too. That is just terrible. Two packs are gross. The only thing I found was the Dexter Hoover Mini Racers 3 pack. Not the other new ones from the case though, which is the high impact case or the high impact pack and the tractor set. But they do have some other relatively new ones. So I will be picking up that for sure. So we're here at Meyer, and they do have somewhat new mini racers. So here's the Lightning McQueen with racing wheels. They also have back here, well, of course, remnants of case D. So Easter buggy McQueen as the Easter buggy. They have Tokyo Mater back there. Mildred Byley looking good. Carney Karsper. And then some 2019 remnants as well. And some old two packs. Kind of disappointing here in Meyer. So we are here at Target and not a terrible selection, but I can already tell them a fast fong is peg warming. I've seen him a lot lately, but none of the others from his case, like Robert Jam Jones or Joe Don Jackson. I mean, Lightning McQueen with cones kind of nice to see, but overall I want the new ones. And they have a little mixture of case E in here as well. Maddie McGear, I might pick her up. I know she's new to Case F or something like that. They have a Brian Spark. I found him yesterday, so no need to pick him up. 
They do have the Cactus Lightning McQueen Radiator Spring Single. No new color changers yet. Some decent mini three packs here. Not the newest wave of them though. So yeah, not too bad overall, but the fast bong's already peg warming. Oh my God. We are now here at Walmart and we have remnants of Case F yet again, but this time a couple more interesting cars like the two Robert Jam Jones. We have Kurt over here. He is a new variant from, well, actually both of which, both Kurt's that have been released were from Thailand, but this one has like a new expression. So I do want to pick him up. The most exciting car here is this Ryan Inside Laney in the NASCAR line. So I will be definitely buying him, but unfortunately everyone else is Lightning McQueen. Kind of disappointed about that. We have Maddie McGear, Brian Spark, Lots of trainer crews, Ramirez, as I've been seeing already. A couple haulers. You have the Wally hauler and Gale. Gale on the 2021 packaging. So, yeah, kind of picked over, but could be worse. So, we are here at Target and they have nearly a full case G. I was very excited to see Hot Rod Louise Nash. Definitely will be picking her up. We have Dash Boardman, new Thailand variants. We'll be picking him up. We have Lane McQueen with Cone. He's from Case F. Lizzie's always nice to see. Always a rare one. A couple Pam Wheel Daros. Kabuto. Haven't seen him yet. I'll snag these Pams, but who is missing, guys? Take a guess. Who is missing? It is none other than the Vuzine Tractor. Very, very disappointing, obviously. He's probably the best from Case G. At least the uh, mass opinion is. They do have a couple of fast fongs, but he's really starting to peg warm. Same with Darren Ledfoot. There's so many of him. So many H.J. Hollis's, so many J.D. McPillars. Darn it. I was really hoping I could have snagged a Vuzine Tractor. That would have been awesome. But no luck. Mini racers, we got some decent three packs here. Nothing too special though. Darn. Here we are at Walmart and the selection looks quite slim. They have zero singles, but for the extended lines, we have a NASCAR Ryan inside Laney, NASCAR Chase, and William Byrev in addition to a slew of Lightning McQueens and you know, there's one Jackson as well. And then we also have new color changers. So not a bad day actually at all. First time I've seen Fillmore. I actually just was at Target. The only thing they had was this. So I didn't record it. So now you get to see it. It's a good move. And yeah, not too bad here after all. I came to Walmart today with one intention, one goal, and that goal has been fulfilled. We have the next gen Walmart hauler who they're calling Marty Hauler. And then Helena Facho, the now named Cal Weathers hauler made in Vietnam. So we'll be picking up both of those. Pretty excited about that. The rest of their selection is pretty garbanzo. Like we got two NASCAR cars and some pretty bad singles, some color changers. But yeah, that's really all I was looking for. So I am delighted. Oh my, oh my guys, today is a big day. This is one of the best targets I've seen in a long time. And on the front here, like on the front of the pegs, it doesn't look very good. You know, we have a Nick shift, but I already took a little peek and it is much better than it looks on the surface. We got rusty corn fuel. My first racing red I've ever found in a store. That's exciting. We have Clovis Ryder back here as well. So all the new guys were on one peg. Here's the other Nick shifts. Let's see what else we have. There's a Sheriff. Dash Boardman. Aiken Axler, the Manny Flywheels. This is a full case, H it appears. I don't think anything is missing whatsoever. They must have just stocked this, so lucky me. Came at the right time. Daryl Cartrip. Hamilton but the other cool thing is that they have a new case of two packs in maybe not down there but up here they have double clutch daily and oh my god 
Okuni and Shigeko, the brand new case of two packs. So I'm pretty excited about that. Definitely a lot of good stuff here that I'll be picking up. So we're here at another Target and they have remnants of a whole bunch of cases. Looks like you have a little bit of D, maybe some F, definitely G. You know, we got Pam Wheelgaro up here, Brian Spark. Not gonna buy any singles, but they do have this two pack now. I'm not really sure. I don't think I discussed this at my last tour, but they updated Parker Brakeson's artwork finally. They put the correct one on there instead of just putting Manny Flywheel. So that's awesome. I will be picking up this for sure because it's such a monumental correction. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it for this store. So yet again, at first glance here at this Walmart, it doesn't look very good. We have a couple haulers. Gail Boffert's now being named Gail Boffert and not just Jackson Storm Hauler. But we have no singles, no two packs. Well, I guess there is one Robert Jam Jones chilling up there. We'll put him over here so he's more envisioned everyone else but the nascar stuff is really solid we first have a chase racelet my first time finding a gogo -Go logano so i'm very pumped about that i needed an extra of him Let's see what else we got oh, there's a ryan and another chase not too bad at all we are here at another walmart and they have some nascar stuff as well haven't seen a william byrev in a while mater haven't seen him either Jam Jones, like another Byrab. Oh my god, there's all over the place. Jackson Storm McQueen, McQueen, McQueen. Jackson Storm. Pick these back up real quick. Jackson, Tailgate, another Robert Jam Jones. Taco, Brian Spark. So some remnants here. Oh, a Todd Marcus. Haven't seen him in a store before. Definitely gonna have to pick up him. I love the Piston Cup Racers from the first movie. Another Chase Racelet. And that appears to be it. No haulers. It's alright though. Pretty good selection. Quite an interesting selection here at Target. We have Remnants of Case F. So, so those Amigos Ramon, Robert Jam Jones. Lane McQueen with Cohn, Brian Spark, and Cass Fong. Then pretty much a full case of the newest two packs. We have Okuni and Shigeko, Parker Brixton, McQueen and Sally, and Double Clutch Daily's hiding down here. Might have to pick him up though. That's about it. This target looks terrible, like barely any singles. And then I looked over here and I was like, wait, what? Are these even supposed to be out yet? I had no idea that these new mini racers have even been found in the U.S. yet. So I'll definitely be picking up them. We have Lizzie and then a whole bunch of racing reds. So that's pretty exciting. I think there was supposed to be another pack with like Dusty Rusties, but clearly he is not here. And they don't have the new pack with Funny Car Mater. Or they're calling him Hot Rod Mater now either. Hmm. So we're here at Target and this is my first time finding the keychain radiator springs cars and it looks like they only have two bug mouth mcqueen and one eye mater but that's all right with me looks like they have some new mini three packs here we have lizzie oh i don't have this one yet dusty rusties that's exciting Let's see if they have the racing red one. Oh, they do how exciting i might pick up an extra not bad but over here ooh, let's not look over there i also have this pack with the funny face mater or the this is not Funny Face Mater, not Funny Car Mater, who they're now calling Hot Rod Mater. So I was at this Target last night and I didn't find Jack Squat. But I'm in the area again and I contemplated coming here and I really didn't want to, but I'm so glad I did because they just restocked with a case of the Keychain Radiator Springs cars. And I've only really found like a couple of these, so I'm going to be purchasing quite a few. Mater, Luigi and Guido I know are new. So that's exciting. Also have Fillmore. Sarge, awesome. I'm pretty stoked about these. These guys have a new expression. So that's pretty cool. So we're here at Meyer today and you can see that they have a great selection of two packs, singles, deluxe, 
Maybe some mini racer three packs up there. They are up there. I'm at AutoZone right now and I am so, so happy I came here. Look at what we found. Sarah Wilson and Floyd Morgan. We'll definitely be picking these bad boys up. Here at Walmart and I found some of the new launchers. They have a bunch of McQueen and Jackson, but they're all like bent. Like see how bent the packages are. They do not have the King or Francesco, but that's okay. And then they just have kind of remnants of some of the latest cases. No new endurance racers. Just looks like case, I don't know, case. J maybe I think this might have been. Nothing too exciting. It appears to have a full case G here. We have Racing Red Sally, Luis Amigos Ramon, Joe Don Jackson. We have the Fast Fawn. A couple Robert Jam Jones and then they even have some remnants from what looks to be case J. I know that's K actually, Rich Hurry. Some NASCAR stuff as well. Nothing else too exciting. We're here at AutoZone and had a massive score. Got Mummy, Luigi, and Guido, and Racing Red Crews. This is so exciting, I love these stores. Looks like we're not going to go three in a row at Walmart. We have some kind of good NASCAR stuff, but nothing I need. And then remnants from whatever single case this is. It's too picked over to even tell. I don't know what it is, but if you go to pretty much any Target in the Midwest, they have like no singles whatsoever. However, this one does have some other redeemable qualities like tons of Pixar Fest, the new Radiator Springs 4-pack back there, a bunch of the keychain guys, some 2-packs, and then this new 11-pack. At first glance, this Walmart looks like garbage. Look at all these launchers, McQueen and Jackson, like, come on. Thankfully though, we do have a Francesco launcher and a The King launcher. It's the first time I've seen either of them. I'm not sure if I'll get The Kings though, because his packaging is a little bent over there, but I'll definitely get Francesco's. And then believe it or not, there is a new endurance racer, Michael Roeder. I do not believe his companion, Flip Dover, is here though, which is very sad. Looks like they just have three McQueens. So the hunt continues. Oh, and then there's a stray Antonio over here. Well, that didn't take long. Here we are in another Walmart and they do indeed have the endurance flipped over. So I'm happy about that. Got another Michael as well. For some reason, every endurance racer has a bent card like this, like every single one for all the tyranny. Got some remnants here. First time I've actually seen a Ron Hover in store. And all the our endurance racers are old, obviously. And that is it. No launchers here. We are here at Target, and I almost just keeled over. I almost just died. Oh my God! You gotta be kidding me. Two new cars that I don't already have, and there's only like a couple here. I cannot believe it. Those are the only two new cars here. Those are the only good ones, really. Wow. Oh my god, they have way too many of these Radiator Springs packs. Got one of those packs, I already got that. Wow, I am absolutely thrilled right now. Oh my god, I didn't even know these were being found at Target yet. Yes, please. Now we are here at Walmart and it looks like they also have remnants of Case Al. However, these remnants are not nearly as good as at Target. So we'll only be getting Marlin here because he is new to 2021 packaging in case L. So I guess that's kind of exciting. I don't know why, there's so many Bob Cullises, I guess, in this case. I don't even know what's in this case. This is a very strange case in that my supplier, Give Me Collectibles, has not received it yet. So I haven't unboxed it. And that marks the first time, as I talked about in my Sarah Wilson review, 
that I actually have found cars from a case in a store before receiving the case. Now the really exciting thing about this Walmart is that, yep, <laughs> bam, we have new NASCAR stuff. So here we have Eric Amaroling, definitely gotta pick him up. That's the first time I've ever seen him in a store. Same thing here with Danny Suarez. That wouldn't have been awesome if I found the 2022 NASCAR stuff. That would have been so cool. Here we have a pick crew Luigi and Guido as well. Let's see what else we have here. Carson Ace Dillon. And it looks like we do even have some new endurance racers. There's flipped over. We did already find him, but it's nice to see him as well. And there's Michael Roder. Wow, this is a fantastic Walmart. If only I got here a little sooner when they stocked this case out here, that would have been ideal. Let's see what else they got up here. Wow, they have a whole nother set of the new endurance racers. Wow. Wow, they have four Michael Roders here. That's wild. And some launchers down there. Not bad. So we're here at Target, and this is the first time I've actually seen the drive-in series in a store before. You guys know I did my video on these a long, long time ago, and they are finally hitting Target stores. So it looks like they have almost everybody. There's Woody, Buzz, PT Flea, Flick. And they have Sully over here. I might pick one guy up, but I already have them all, I believe. We got Fillmore, the keychain guy back there so that's kind of nice got some good keychain ones and then remnants of ksl and some new multi-packs oh kind of trash here at this target but what's it gonna be what's it gonna be what's it gonna be a new color changer no way just one color changer in the entire rack and it happens to be a new one no snot rod though we're having some pretty good luck today here at another target and they have the new mini three packs so we have larry camper and Tex Dynaco. Unfortunately, it appears that Carla Veloso's mini pack is not here, so that kind of stinks. And then we also have remnants of Case L. So you can see Chisaki, Marlin, and Doc are all new to the packaging. So I'll pick up Doc, but yeah, they don't have any other good ones, sadly. Oh my goodness. This is kind of a messy section here. I mean, not only is everything all sprawled out, look at this. And then look at that. I don't know what's going on. It's a little weird. 